All right. So KPNS, KTPA. We are at the airport. And it looks like runway eight. Go away. Will be our best wind. Yep. We'll go ahead and fire up the plane. Jack Center is online, 135, 925. <clears throat> let's see, let's go ahead and get a route. Chopper prop jet piston, go back to the iPad. All right, so this screen, I'm going to try to select a route to follow. Put there a motor weight altimeter, two nine or five one. This one looks good. All right, so <clears throat> we've got our route and now our arrival. Giant 3325, I need to give you an odd, odd altitude. Uh, what altitude would you prefer? Madden or correction, I need to give you an even altitude. What would you prefer? the orange since we're coming from that direction and then we can probably pick giant go giant 33 25 heavy jack fuel center inside the arrival and we can go ahead and pick 28 for now but we don't know which one they're going to be using so we'll go ahead and add that thank you and now we're going to copy that into vPilot. All right, I think our flight plan is ready, and we're not going to put it into the... Giant 3325 Heavy, would you prefer flight level 360 plane. or 380? So there's no tower, Jet ground, 2251 or Jacksonville Center. We're going to stay on his frequency. So Triple 2251, descend by the get out one arrival, Orlando <laughs> altimeter 2977. 925 with you. We're going to be cleared to Tampa, probably as filed. So I'll go ahead and put that if that ends up being American what happens, at 330 radar con uh, Route is any far. specific waypoints that they give me. Altitude, they're going to give me. Three or four thousand, give or take, and then Yankee, eight, another one, ten minutes Jack left for right contact, for our fifty miles west of the Charleston. Oh, they're using the Fire of privacy and clear of that is one seven. Oh, that's the guy that's right here. Enough. Let me switch this so you can see. Right here. Yeah, that's this Yankee, guy. Yankee Victor One Jack Center. So what I'll probably do is go ahead and just let him know that I'm waiting. Jacksonville Center, Citation 173, Romeo Lima. Citation 173, Romeo Lima, Jacksonville Center, go ahead. Uh, looking to pick up IFR to Tampa. Citation 173, Romeo, Romeo Lima, Jacksonville, or clearance on request number one. All right, so clearance is on request, and which means he's trying to look up and see my flight plan and make sure that it's applicable, and then he'll come back to me. Oh boy, already got to go to the bathroom. E418. I'm going to go ahead and start the plane before my uh, friggin' battery dies. Express, Mitch Austin, Executive Airport. So I'll switch to here. And Walker 3418, whenever so can you please let me know your approach request in the Charleston Executive Airport? Lights on. And. Roger the support. Okay, 34 18. We'll go ahead and get started. Looking for N2 at 20% right here. And 
and there's 20. We can go ahead and fire up right engine. And we'll go ahead and start our prep to enter the flight plan. Turn off the head tracking because that's I'm sure. Yankee annoying. Victor One Jacksville Center D Center maintain flight level four three zero. So K P N S two K T P A and exact performance in it. Delta thirteen sixty eight Jacksville Center Squawk one zero seven three. One person on board. We'll say one hundred fifty pounds of cargo. Our cruise altitude per four flight. Roger that, 36, uh, Victor, Carlson Airport at your two o'clock and one seven miles of port in sight. Flight level three seven. Three six, Chile, Victor, cleared visual approach, runway one eight. And we are probably going to be departing runway eight. That should be what we pick. But he might give me one seven. And unfortunately, I just have to wait for him to come back to me. So, let's see. Walker, at 3418, would you like the visual approach? Take off. I got to set a takeoff. So, outside air temperature is 2 4. Roger, Walker, 3418, expect visual approach. Wrong by 1 8. Per four flight, the weather is, or the wind is 290 at 6 knots. Or walk at 34, I my flight. Expect visual Six. approach on my 2 2. Excuse me. Next. And we can't get our V1s until we select our runway. So we can go ahead and start the next engine. Now that you're. Captain Bill Center, I'm approaching from Mariner. Approaching runway 17 and localize as we see this. What am I missing? Legs, departure. Top of uniform, 9 9, wind. There's no departure. Wind 290 at 6, runway 17, clear to land. From Pensacola. 20. Alright, we are above 20 on into fire up engine 1. Frontier 2433, Shack Hill Center, Squawk 1041. We'll turn on the climate. Rest of the lights. Hundred jet three six Juliet Victor wind two four zero at nine or runway one eight clear to land. Do we have emergency lights not armed, so we can arm those. Pedo heat on, and the only warning we've got left is our parking brake. Delta fourteen fifty eight eight uh, number one seven three Romeo Lima I have your clearance advisor to copy. One seven three is ready to copy. Over one seven three Romeo Lima clear to the Tampa Airport redirect is bare than as filed. Climb maintain 3000, expect flight level 3, uh, expect flight level 37010 minutes after departure, departure with me, squawk 3054. Alright, uh, cleared Tampa as filed, direct to VARRE, uh, 3000, expect 3, 30, flight level 37, 10 minutes after departure, uh, frequencies with you, and squawk 3059. Number 173, Romeo Lima, squawk 3054. 3054, cannot read my own hand or anything, thanks. Number 173, Romeo Lima, read back, correct, call for taxi, expect runway. Expect runway 26 for departure. Alright, we'll expect 26 for departure and we'll call you in just a few minutes. Thank you for 173, Romeo Lima. 305, and we're going to go ahead and put our initial altitude of 3000 into, here I'll go ahead and switch back to this, 3,000, golly, into our autopilot. We will probably climb flight level change mode at, I'll leave that blank for right now, you know what, uh, let's say vertical speed mode at 3,000. Frontier 2433, radar contact, 25 miles west of the Alma VOR, maintain flight level 340. And we don't have a heading yet, but he said we're going to take off on runway. Delta 1458, Jacksville Center. I should really try and remember this stuff better. 
1458, so we'll go ahead and put 26. Delta 1458, cross Mady, add and maintain a 1-1000, 10-5 two nine eight one. All right, we are ready to taxi. Cross Mady, add and maintain 1-1-11,000, altimeter 2981. And per uh, the... So we are parked Delta right here at Industry Jet Center. We're going to taxi Miami Center closed, no further ATC via Delta to terminal. Service change approved. Yeah. And we are direct to VAR. So actually, I didn't put that in. Uh, that's going to be before go, Joe. So we'll put that there. And then LE. Yankee Victor 11 at pilot's discretion. They should maintain one six thousand. Daytona Beach altimeter two nine seven three. And then go, Joe. Execute. All right, so now our flight plan looks right. And now we're ready to take off, or at least to taxi. I'll wait for one more radio call to make sure I'm not stepping on anybody else. Or maybe not. Jacksonville Center, Citation 173, Romeo Lima, ready for taxi. Civil 173, Romeo Lima, runway 26, taxi via Delta. Taxi via Delta to 26 for 173, Romeo Lima. All right. I'm going to lock my chair so I don't move. And get our head track in set up. Let's look correctly. There we go. All right. Uh, parking brake off. And we're going to plow through the ground crew here a little bit. Taxi lights are on. No more warning lights. Excuse me, sir. All right, we'll go ahead and put flaps down so we don't forget that. And landing lights will go ahead and come on. Sterling's 389, check. Why is this thing not dropping my flaps? Mile final runway 26. Approaching runway 26. I hear you. Roger, hold short runway 27 left. Approaching runway 26. That's a 321, hold short runway 27 left. Did my flaps button die? Eh, uh, nah. Put some Southwest up, but not 50, down. Southwest 5150, cross Jerry, add and maintain, fall level 210 and 280 knots. See, heading, probably gonna make a left turn. Jacksonville Center, Citation 173, Romeo Lima, holding short 26, ready for takeoff. Citation 173, Romeo Lima, on departure turn, right heading 360. Wind, Arjuna, on departure turn, left heading 180. Wind 290 at 6, runway 27, quick for takeoff. Uh, clear for takeoff on 26, left heading 180 for 173 Romeo Lima. All right, he got the runway wrong, but he's not here, so that's okay. Runway 26, 6,900 feet remaining. Typically 2251, expect the ILS. 6,900 feet remaining, I'd say we're good. So we're going to climb up to about 1,000 feet. Fairlings 389, we'll turn right turn. heading. Zero seven zero, descend and maintain three thousand. Two one eight zero. Alright. Southwest. Oh, oh, I forgot to put in my speeds. Cross Olean, maintain oh, we are definitely 1, going fast enough. Tampa altimeter two nine eight one. All right, positive rate, gear coming up. One fifty and climbing. Two nine eight one. All right, positive rate, gear coming up. One fifty and climbing. I'm gonna pull back the power just a bit because this thing will American heavily overspeed. American three thirty radar service terminated. Brake change changer proof. See ya. Six hundred feet and climbing. Man, this thing is just so not set up right. Alright, we're United thirteen ninety five Jack Spoken Earth Walk one zero four six. Jeffrey twenty two fifty one turn right heading two five zero descent and maintain four thousand vectors for approach. Alright, landing gears up, flaps are actually up, our button worked, landing lights off, taxi lights November off. November 173, Romeo Lima, 
Jackson, I've our contacts, uh, she's leaving. Leaving 2000 uh, for 3000 for 173 Romeo Lima. 173 Romeo Lima, proceed direct to Vare, climb, maintain flight level 370. Direct to Vare and climb to flight level 37 for 173 Romeo Lima. All right, so we have our instructions. We'll go direct. Oh, I can't click it because my head's bobbing. Oh, execute. Nav mode. Should get a nice left turn out of that. And we'll set our... Uh, all the way up to 37. Jackson, Delta, say good evening. Delta 320 with you. And flight level 302. Entering the Mate 4 arrival of the Tampa. Flight level change mode at 225 knots indicated until we get above 10,000. And we'll see what it looks like up there. Goodbye, Pensacola. Let's see. Probably not going to get any instructions for a little bit. All right, I don't see any flaps down. Center, good. Gears up. Evening. Oh, all looks good. Yeah, we're going to be taking off over. Let's go freeze the Stand bit by. of land right in front of us to the south. Delta 321. Uh, sales should leaving tonight then. All right, we are in the climb detent, which is indicated here. CLB for climb. Climb in all Walker the way to 37,000 feet. Turn right. All right, they're coming up on 10,000. They're climbing at 4,100 feet a minute. Frequency, just stand by, please. Every, we'll get to everybody in a minute. Everybody stand by on the frequency. Stand by. Ooh. Walker 3418, fly heading 150. All right, there's 10,000. I'm going to change my flight level change speed up a little bit so we will ascend more, a little more slowly. 389. A little quicker. Flying 150. Alright, we still have, if I flip over to the VATSIM map Triple real quick, two, we still got, we are right here. Le left heading we still got full ATC coverage all right the way until 18, Tampa, 3, we're going to lose Jack Center, and then we'll switch to Tampa Approach as we get closer. He's been on for two hours and two minutes, though, so there's a decent chance that he'll stay on center, Delta before we get a chance to get there. Okay. Lose altitude. 102 miles from Heaven. Center emergency, emergency. Uh, this is going to be Air Force 22 Alpha is out of fuel in both tanks. So it looks like Gainesville Regional is off to my, like, oh, no. 8 o'clock requesting landing at Gainesville Regional. Hmm. Uh, if we're uh, off, clear to land anywhere when we at Gainesville Airport. Hey, front, thank you. That's first. I haven't seen that before. Heard that on the on network. Twenty-one. Good night. November three, Romeo Lima. Do you have the Mate four arrival on the aircraft? That is affirmative. We've already got that program in for a three Romeo Lima. For three Romeo Lima, you clear the Tampa airport via the Mate four arrival and able to direct the Heaven intersection. We are already direct to Haven, and we will follow the maybe uh, arrival for three Romeo Lima. Three, three, I'm going to lay across Mady at maintain 11000, Tampa altimeter 2983. Cross Mady at 11000 for three, I'm going to lay And yeah, that's actually what we just set up. But he wants me to cross it. Jack Center Squawk 1057. 11,000. So I want to make sure that my Yankee FMS Victor 1 on the wind doesn't uh, drop me. 2501, you're only 25 right, Cordelan. At 11. I want to find Clark Lane, Yankee Victor 1. Jacksonville Center, Raptor 22 Alpha, requesting All right, right IFR here, we're coming up on our descent. New Orleans. Where are you? Their B, B path is blinking. At Jacksonville, sorry about that. And we are descending, and I've got to pull power back, because this does not have an auto throttle, and I make sure I don't overspeed the plane. I'm going to try and keep it around 240, 245, somewhere in there. Yeah. Circuit 2037, flood runway heading, runway 18 clear for takeoff, <laughs> the winds uh, 2406. These are going to be some serious types of runway heading, clear for takeoff, runway 18, American 2037. All right, Delta 1457, contact Tampa approach, 118.15. One over here. One eight, and we're right going to go to signature. So we're going to land. We're probably not going to be able to turn off into a Whiskey 5, maybe 6. Whiskey. 
Victor 5, Uniform, Bravo 2, Bravo, Bravo 1, Golf. We're going to have to probably ask for intermediate taxi instructions on that. Jacksonville Center, Citation 173, Romeo Lima. Can you confirm uh, approach for 01 left at Tampa? Uh, it's going to be with Tampa Approach. That's Miami Center, so they're landing south currently. So, uh, or actually north, apologies. So, yeah, uh, I'm not sure which runway he's going to give you. <laughs> okay, I was just trying to prep my approach. I appreciate it. Jack Center, Air Canada, 915 with you. He's not ready to hand me off yet, but now he probably will because I annoyed him. Okay. Why is it so quiet? Altitude. So somebody messaged me on uh, vPilot, which is the plug-in, so that I can chat on VATSIM directly, and they said that uh, Tampa is doing the Detroit IMS. 3066, contact Orlando, approach 124.8. Or one left. And they're doing a localizer on one, one right. 124.8, very so That's why I went ahead and programmed that in. Delta 1162, contact Orlando, approach 124.8, we'll see. I'm really annoyed that my flap is buttoned. Or not here, Whiskey. Looks like uh, Tampa doesn't want the handout. They're going to be closing. Radar services terminated. Frequency change approved. Called it. We're switching to Unicom um, for November 7th. Oh. 3 Romeo Lima. Tampa's closing. Damn. Radar services terminated. Frequency change approved. Over to Unicom. Thank you for the awesome ATC, sir. Welcome. Actually, a 3 Romeo Lima. Looks like you took your track. I'm not sure what's going on over there. Uh, go ahead and give Tampa Approach a call on 118.15, and uh, he'll drop you if he doesn't want you, I guess. All right, I'll do that. Thank you again, sir. All right, 118.15. Maintain the 2600 to establish clear hours from late one. That was not an appropriate radio call, but it's okay. Tampa approach, citation 173, Romy Lima. I know you're signing off. I uh, just want to confirm the ILS for one left. I mean, by the time you get here, I'm, I'm going to be off, so. Alrighty then. Thank you, sir. Have a good night. Thank you. You too. <laughs> Maku, turn right heading. What? Uh, Terminal heading 340, maintain 2600 till established. Clear ass, runway 1 left approach. V long. 340, maintain 26 till established. Close the ILS 1 left, southwest 2470. You're gone. And Delta 335 and already runway 28, clear to land, wind 27012, gust 21. So we got V long. Oh, clear to land, runway 28, Delta 335. And Delta 321, I'm going to be out before you get there. So now we got a nice. No problem, Delta 321. Left and American 820, I feel bad for factoring out that, that far, but I'm closing up here so you can monitor you. Come All right, we are on main path now and descending appropriately. Left. Roger, thanks. Now, what's really going to get fun is we're all going to be on Unicom, and we're all going to be trying to land at the same time. All right, time. and with that, Tampa approach is now offline. Retro service terminated, free is change approved. Have a good night, guys. And now yeah. we get to figure it out ourselves. Have a good one. All right, over to Unicom. Tampa traffic, Frontier Airbus taxiing uh, one left via Fox, Victor 3, Whiskey, Tampa. Get some. Tampa traffic, Citation 173, Romeo Lima on the ILS for 01 left, still heading south, about to make our turn back to the north. So I'm just letting everybody know approximately where we're at. So we got one plane ahead of Who's us. Who's on the ILS for one left? Citation 173, Romeo Lima. We're actually just west of the airport now, heading south, and then going to make our turn back to the north. At uh, Southwest 2471, we're actually on the ILS for one left as well. We're crossing, we're about to cross Cruise now. Cruise. Correction, I'm sorry, we just crossed the Lagoo, so we're about 10 miles now for the ILS one left. And I do have you in sight and on the TCAT. 10-4, I got the same for you. All righty. Lagoo. Now kiss. Do we have to? Can I pronounce you plain and plain? <laughs> so that's Lagoo. Now it says Southwest 1123, but he did not. It's not what he said. That's funny. 
I'll switch back over to the sim. Camp traffic, is, Kepler, temp to choose, clear, runway one left on Whiskey 4, taxi to ramp right via here. Victor. There's a lot coming into Tampa, so I see. Yeah, it's a busy right now. It's more fun trying to figure it out on our own. We have fun here. <laughs> We're doing a good job, guys. <laughs> no bad airs yet. Don't say it. Hey, hey. Tampa Southwest 2471, uh, short final, and uh, wind shear out of 1,000 for incoming traffic for uh, Tampa traffic. Hey, Sensation, uh, what's that uh, doing? Do you think, do you think we're spaced out enough for me to turn towards Lagoon? Uh, it's 79 Sierra Whiskey. Uh, yeah, I think so. I'm, I'm crossing Lagoon right now, so you should be good. All right, traffic, double yes, point, 27, final runway 28. Tampa traffic, citation 173, Romeo Lima, 10 mile final, runway 1 left. Left. Oh, we stepped on each other. Dude, that cross one is insane. I was totally expecting the RNAV 28, not 1 left. It's like 100% crosswind. Oh yeah, we got a wind shear all the way down till touchdown. <laughs> Let's turn on our TCAS. TCAS on. Tampa traffic 173 Romeo Lima, six mile final runway one left. We didn't need approach. Look at this spacing, it's beautiful. This was great, guys. <laughs> All right, dude, let me go down. There we go. Oh, I need to. I need to see. Yeah, traffic, uh, citation 789 Sierra Whiskey will be following the. All right, we are below flaps 15. We'll be flying the. I can't drop my flaps because my flap button A320 broke. For zero months. We're gonna go ahead and put our flaps down. Planning lights on. I see four white pappy lights, and I missed. Autopilot. I don't know why my approach didn't arm, but it didn't. So we're gonna do a rapid descent here. Autopilot off. All right, we are well within landing gear, and we're gonna go flaps all the way down to 35, because we need to make a quick descent. We got four white peppy lights on the left of the runway. Tampa traffic frontier, buses off of one left, one dozen, two hundred unlanded, one last call to partners in the north of Tampa. All right, getting a little low on the speed. And we have a 22 knot crosswind. Tampa this traffic, American A20, short final runway, zero one left. Did you say short final? Yeah, short final, zero one left. <laughs> well, Tampa traffic 173 Romeo Lima, also short final, zero one left. Two miles. Well, they made a air crash investigation coming here. Oh, shit. I do not have a visual on you. I am currently at 1,400 feet. I'm a little high, descending quickly. I have you in sight. I'm at um, 1,100 feet. And you are behind me? Yeah, I guess I'm behind you. All right, I'm gonna make a quick exit off this runway then. All right, I'm at minimum. Mile final runway zero one left. I really don't know why my approach mode didn't arm. Got my popcorn. 500. Maybe I'll just land long. What are you flying, sir? An Airbus. Um... Oh, an Airbus. Okay, I'll just get off the runway. We all. Yeah, no worries for Airbus. We're coming in hot. Have a traffic citation 79 zero whiskey final final zero. God, final. this freaking crosswind is nuts. Everyone send a prayer up for Mark Flight Simulator as it is currently breaking for me. All right, hold on. I've been having some problem with my, I don't know what it is, but my screen like flashes every now and then. I don't know. I do not know why at all. Oof. Oh, that was my Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 for you. Absolutely on short from smooth, crisp 60 frames per second 
to chuggy two frames per second. See, this is why I'm prepared still. Tampa traffic, 73 Romeo Lima is off of one left at Whiskey 6. That is some serious crosswind. Kind of right. Is someone landing 2 8 right now? That'd be me. Wow. <laughs> okay. Where? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Come on, turn on. Stupid Watching controller. Watching you from a thousand feet in the air. Dang. That was super, super legal. And I got like 5 FPS right now. We are in full realism, and it didn't crash me, so I guess it accepted that landing. I'm probably going to go ahead and cut the stream here instead of taxiing for 15 minutes and boring everybody. But, uh, everybody's still watching. I appreciate it. And have a good night.